This video shows you how to create a map from data in a KML file and create a map from point data in an Excel file. In order to create a map visualization, you need to load point data from an Excel or KML file or area data from a KML file. In this example, we will use a KML file that contains the locations of the stadiums for the 2014 World Cup in Brazil. By default, all fields are selected in the data selection dialog, even if they do not contain any data. Although there is nothing wrong with loading empty fields, it can be inconvenient to have them when you are working with the map visualization. This is the script that is generated when you load the KML file. Now you can edit the sheet and add a map chart to the sheet. Add your previously uploaded data as a dimension, and a map showing the locations will appear. Point data can be read from Excel files. Two formats are supported, point data stored in one column or two. If the point data is stored in two columns, by clicking on the Prepare Data option to load the table, the latitude and longitude fields are recognized and a geopoint is created automatically. When you open the table in Data Manager, the geopoints have been created. Now if you edit the sheet, you can create a map chart using the geopoints you've just uploaded. For performance reasons, the number of points that can be displayed is limited to 3,333. However, a display value of over 1,000 on a single map may affect readability. By making selections, you can reduce the amount of data to display. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.